Doja Burns. All right, we are back with another episode of Pressure. And y'all know I can't do this without my girl because why? It is big brunch time. And what's brunch without a mimosa? Mm -hmm. So we got creative cocktails in the building again today. What you got today, baby? What's up, guys? So today I got something for you because you know you had like shook it up yesterday. So we're going to do something creative today. We're making smoky pineapple lemonade mimosas. I love lemonade. So you ready? And I let it smoke. But guess what else? We're gonna add a little flavor. Oh. So you can add peach. Ooh, mm. girl, you finna blow my mind. Yep, and so over here, let's get going. Over here, I have, I'm gonna do a New York steak strip mm. steak with uh, some fresh pepper and onion. Okay. But right here is where the real magic gonna happen because we doing egg and rice and not just any kind of egg and rice. We're gonna do jazzy oh. egg and rice. Let me we see what we got. Up. So right here, I just did like a mixture of bell pepper and green onion. Okay. I, it, I like the flavor that it's going to give to the meat. And I have beef sausage and turkey sausage. I do not eat pork. So um, mm -hmm. we got to make this because I want some too. This, this, okay, this well, let's get to up. work. I'm here to assist you if you need my little hands. So Anywhere. we just going to let our skillet and stuff like that get hot so far. Mm -hmm. We already took the liberty of cooking our rice. And a, the good thing about this, is it really does not take long. Mm -hmm. And also, I'm gonna do some eggs in this pot. So mm -hmm. what I'm gonna do is move this rice okay, this way. Okay, wash my hands so we can get Perfect. going. Perfect. Yes, y'all, cleanliness. We want to keep our <laughs> hands clean. You wanna keep our utensils clean. You wanna just a clean workspace because you know you're putting this into your body, you know? So we wanna do right. But like I said, I have some fresh white rice, Ooh. white rice that I cook and strained, or I can. I already showed y'all how to cook rice, so we won't even have to go through that. But you cook your rice first, and everybody cook egg and rice different. So this is going to be interesting. Okay, well let's see what we got going. First, so what's first, first thing first, I'm gonna put all my meat in here, mm -hmm. and you want to hear a sizzle. Mm -hmm. That's the the beauty of getting your pot warm. Mm -hmm before you start. And I spoke to you guys about that before. So we're gonna let that just work Hello. how it's working. But I'm gonna get you to put me a little butter in that big pot okay. there. But first we're gonna turn it on. Okay. Get it turned on. Let me Make get sure out put a little in butter. Little Thank you kindly, honey. No problem. Butter. So right. put all the butter in. So do you measure your butter or can I just like put one? Uh, no, two? I just, I'm a, uh, just have you, you could do three. Okay. Yeah. So we'll let go, I measure those. Yeah, cause we are gonna come back, yeah. But I usually okay. use about three, maybe four cubes mm -hmm. because um, with the eggs, once we let it melt, we're gonna cook our eggs. Now these eggs have been pre-scrambled. I mm -hmm. scrambled, then add season and scramble again. Okay, do you put milk in your eggs? Because... Some people do, but I don't. Okay. I just feel like that's a lot going on mm -hmm. and really, I'm not a big egg person, but I eat this because it's meaty okay. and it won't be more, it's gonna be more of a meat, more meat than eggs mm -hmm. to this ratio. Cause okay. again, I don't like chicken. I don't eat chicken mm -hmm. and that's chicken. Eggs come from chicken, chicken come from eggs. Don't you know tell me, saying? don't tell me, don't tell me. So yeah, I, I just don't do the chicken. Mm -hmm. And with this turkey sausage, it, this, this sausage is not gonna take long at all. So okay. that's why. And, uh oh, you know, I'm a uh, cook everything mm -hmm. as you go type of girl. Don't worry about that. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna cook everything as you go type of girl. And then you can okay. smell these aromas and yes, you see they the. smell so good. Yeah, they mesh well together. So while you're doing that, mm -hmm. I'm gonna go ahead and grab an steak. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go ahead on and add a little corn pepper, black corn pepper. Y'all know this is my favorite. Working, working. 
black corn pepper, and uh, a little pink chameleon salt. Okay, so listen, I see you use that pink salt all the time. Why the pink salt and not the regular salt? Because it's much healthier. It's just okay. way healthier. It's way, way healthier. So what we're going right. to do, turn that down a little bit. Yeah, because I'm going to go ahead and pass you these eggs, but I'm going to do a quick little shake right on the roll real quick. Okay, let me get a spatula. I'm back again, y'all, flipping with my spatula. <laughs> okay. Keep making it up. And um, I'm gonna get you to give me a skillet. A good one. Fresh. Mm -hmm. Got that buttermilk that you got in my buttermilk. Yes, looking real it's good. looking good. It's ready for those eggs. Let yes, me see, Jay Z, whip it up. Because listen, my eggs be like a little dry and stuff. <laughs> Let me see these fluffy eggs because yes, so help a play um, out. with eggs again. Like I said, mm -hmm. the key to everything is having a high skillet already. Your butter's already melted. Mm -hmm. You got your a nice temperature going. Eggs cook really fast. Right now, I'm getting this skillet together. For my vegetables. Ooh. It's just an onion and yellow pepper mm. for my steak, but I want you to take a good look at this turkey. Ooh, that be and sausage. Sauteed with your bell pepper. All that's gonna make a difference. Mm -hmm. this, all this is flavor. Okay. It's gonna make a huge difference. And all that's for our eggs, right? So are we gonna put that inside the eggs? Or are you gonna like mix it up with the well, rice? Well, this right here is for my steak. Okay, so when we I'm gonna lay my steak on top of it, and mm -hmm. I'm really big on. Okay, let me talk to you about the seasoning. Okay, so what I did was onion powder, garlic powder, mm -hmm. you know, granulated all the way. Okay, a little dried parsley. We we'll use fresh mm -hmm. parsley another time. Okay, so we got that'll a little dried parsley, work. and you know we hit it with a little Tony, Tony saturated, a little razzle dazzle. We're just gonna do a little quick little stir because you see how it's forming. Mm -hmm. And you see, I use the same spoon, which I never do, but I want to get that good green and good, you all know, I want all those, you, it, yes, I want them co-mingling. Okay, that'll work. But I'm not going to do that with my steak, you know, mm -hmm. I'm going to use something different for that. But okay. while that's sizzling, I'm going to move that around a little bit. Okay. And nice keep my eye out on them eggs, because it's easy to have a conversation and forget what you're doing. Mm -hmm. So when it comes down to breakfast, what is your go-to? What's like, what's your favorite thing? Because I know you, okay. you said you like the grits. I do. So my go-to is normally like the chicken and waffles. I'm really big mm -hmm. on chicken. And steak and eggs because like I really love steak. It's my shit. <laughs> I really love eggs, but I'm one of those people like I love my eggs scrambled. But like, let me tell you a little secret. I like to scramble my eggs, but I also have to eat like a hard egg on the side. Mm -hmm. Why? Uh -huh. I don't know. Yes, because it's something about a hard egg that just go with a steak like. Steak and eggs. I'm gonna have to see. I'm gonna have to see. Well, hopefully this meets your expectations. It smells good. Yeah. It smells really, really good. I cannot wait. Hopefully this meets so, your expectations. So what you got going on over there? All right, so if you're ready, then we'll start working over here. First, we're gonna pop the bubbly because you know we always bring the bubbly for any event. So guys, like I told y'all yesterday, we're gonna always, always use Really good champagne, okay? None of that fake stuff. That's Only right. the good stuff. That's so right. we're gonna pop the top on this and we'll get it started. So today, we're gonna make a pineapple lemonade mm. mimosa and we're gonna add a flavor to it. So we're gonna give y'all something different. We're gonna be creative today. What flavor are you taking them? Where you taking them to? We're taking them to the island, baby. That's Lord. This Only because real Caribbean over here and shit. What go better with steak, eggs, and pineapples? And you got it. Ooh. So y'all heard what she said. Steak, eggs, 
a pineapple drink. And we're gonna top it off with a little peaches, baby. So as we get this bottle open. Okay, so I just wanna show you mm -hmm. my egg. Okay, now see mine could never look like that. They got a little bit more to go, just mm -hmm. so you didn't know they all the way cooked. You don't want to see no liquidy type egg, but this okay. is just fluff. And I'm gonna get a little saucer. I'm gonna turn my eggs down a little bit. Okay. And I'm gonna get a saucer and take it out just so you can get a pretty good feel. That'll work. A little what pop I, And y'all can see pop. exactly how I, they're supposed to look. Ooh, you better pop that bottle. Bubbly, baby. Yes. And while she's getting that together, I wanna show you guys these eggs. Mm -hmm. This is eggs, honey. This is how I like my eggs. Nice and fluffy. And then you can stop it now because you know you have to cook it down in the rice. So what we're gonna mm -hmm. do is we're gonna move that off the fire and we're gonna pull our rice back this way. Okay. And we also gonna multitask and flip mm -hmm. our steaks. All right, get them going. That. Keep it going. So keep guys, it going. I'm gonna drop the magic so that we can see it smoke. That part. Let's get ready, guys. All right, Jazzy. Cause you know Ooh, everything la. sizzles. Ooh la la. Why you doing that? All right. So guys, pay attention. You can always go back and add more champagne, okay? We don't Remember want it to like. our kitchen rule, you can take it. You, can, you can't take it out, but you can, can put it back in. can always add. So we're gonna add a little flavor. Yes. Jazzy love peaches and so do I. Yes, talk to them. And here you go, guys. So. These are the smoky pineapple lemonade mimosas. Not only is it smoking, but it's pressure, baby. Only thing we know is pressure here. Hello. I cannot wait to try this, honey. Ting, ting. Ting. So I just took my eggs, I'm gonna sit this right here because I will be mm, back to that. So good. I took my eggs and okay. I just moved them to a plate, mm -hmm. left my same pot, added some butter. Okay, okay. So what we're doing now is, since our eggs are fully cooked, mm -hmm. I'm just buttering this up a little bit. Then okay. it cook down a little bit and we're gonna add our rice. This is how I do mine. Mm -hmm. So I get me some rice. So we can always go back and add more rice, right? Yes, but see what I'm, what I do, I like buttery, real, real buttery oh, rice. Me too, JSD. So yes, <laughs> I'ma add some rice. I mm -hmm. put the butter at the top too. So okay. I add the rice, then add some. And once and all I'll my stir butter is for you, it, and I'ma let you stir. I got you. Teamwork make I the dream add work. This extra little butter. Mm-hmm. Let that cook down like that. And we're gonna layer it. Once that, that rice is buttered real good, okay. we're gonna just layer that mm -hmm. with that. Okay. You know? We're gonna layer that with that. Shake, shake, shake. And it actually. We got this going over here, baby. Yes. And see how your rice is turning real yellow like? Mm -hmm. And it's, it's moisturized. You want all your rice to have that little coat yes, to it. Yes, that coat, that buttery coat. You want Do you ever eat like butter rice and chicken? Fucking right. Oh, that's my shit. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> that's, that's some awful shit. shit. I ain't gonna lie. I could go all the way as far back as corn and rice. Come on now, don't do that. Talk Cause that's my favorite stuff, girl. the creamy style corn. Stop playing. Ooh, back in the days it was the, mm. I ain't do the cream corn. I did a regular corn with me, a fried pork chop. Can we have it? 
I would not bring a pork chop in this motherfucker. You could get you a turkey sauce, you get your lamb. No, sauce. but can I get a steak then? Another steak? Oh, fucking right. Can I'm gonna do that all the time. Can I get an air fryer? But well, here's the thing we might do this on pressure. What I'm gonna do oh. is get that pork chop and a bottle of coke. Um, oh, oh. Oh, what? No, you're not. That's, no, we're not. Sit it on the counter. That's not what we're going to do. Take it out the pack. That's not what we're going to do. Pour that coke on there, and I want you to see how many little parasites just jump out of there. Now, if you do that, that's going to really hurt my feelings. Mm -hmm. That's how I was hurt. I was a pork chop. That's going to really hurt my feelings. Nobody out pork chop me, baby. I still, I still tell my son, I got this urge. I want a pork chop. It's like a drug. Now, if you do that, now I'm going to be really, I'm going to have to take a drink. Now, look, I want you guys to see how buttery. This rice is. You see how it's wet. You see me okay. working the wrist, working the wrist, you working the it. wrist. I know y'all seen it. So we don't want our fire to be up mm -hmm. that high. We're okay. gonna turn it down to like a three or a two mm -hmm. because we're remembering that everything is already pre-cooked. So you're not mm -hmm. really overcooking it. Look at those eggs. Beautiful eggs. Yellow, fluffy. Just like I like them. Yes. And I'm gonna get you to mix that in real quick okay. for me. Okay. Just out the way. Don't mind me, y'all, because I'm just having fun. And we are just having fun. Girls just want to have fun. Girls and drink. Ting, ting. Brunching. We brunching in money. Yo, girl, don't take you out to brunch. That Get rid of them. Get rid of them. Better come by Jazzy's. And creative. <laughs> <laughs> so while you stirring, I'm just going to go ahead on and okay, add me another take layer. the liberty of add yes. Lord. Okay, okay. Yes, Lord. Oh. Only Sorry, if y'all can see this and taste this. It's Mardi Gras. Hello. <laughs> we need beads. We should have a Mardi Gras edition. We definitely should. I could definitely do some candy. And I'm going to wear like coconuts on my breast, y'all. Watch my head. <laughs> we here for it. So I'm just going to come back where she left off. And of course, we got to add some seasoning to this. Cause okay. That's just what we do. Now, we're gonna be very light with it. And I'ma just but, stir. Um, Talk shows, podcasts, live event coverage. TheAntidote.com has a little something for everybody. You don't have time to come out to an event. You don't have time to set up an interview. That's fine. We just ask that you support us on our journey as we support those around us. Simply follow, share, like, subscribe. And you can help us go further in our efforts to bring businesses, artists, entertainers, etc., further on their journey. Tap in with us over at The Antidote. Support who supports you. It's a movement. All right, so we are back, and here's our finished product. We have our jazzy egg and rice with our beef sausage and our turkey sausage layered on top of our New York steak strip. Mm. Yes, Lord. And we have a our smoky pineapple lemonade mimosa toast. Mm. First of all, cheers to this banging ass breakfast we about to eat, as well as these banging ass mimosas. And you have been pressurized and you are locked in with who? Jazzy and your girl Lady cocktails. Cocktail. Let's go. Pressure. Period.